As Turkey is gradually emerging as a drone superpower, its key allies Russia and Pakistan have shown tremendous interest in its UAVs and anti-drone systems. A southern Turkey-based firm, National War Technologies Defense Systems, has developed an early warning air defense system named Kalka to counter the threat posed by unmanned aerial vehicles UAV, and looks like Pakistan and Russia could be its first buyers. Pakistan, Russia keen for Turkish drones. A report Turkish news agency in Daily Saba has claimed that the company is now set to export the anti-drone system to countries like Russia and Pakistan. The vehicle-mounted anti-drone system has the ability to conduct frequency tracing. The system's radars, which depend entirely on domestic software, can perceive and prevent a target from up to 5,000 meters. Becker Yalchim, Research and Development R&D coordinator of the firm, told reporters that it is also effective against her drone attacks. The firm, which has obtained the necessary permission for mass production of Kalka, has drawn global attention. Yalchim said, so far, there are demands from Russia, Sri Lanka, Bangladesh, Malaysia, Qatar, Pakistan, Afghanistan, and the United Arab Emirates. The first exports of the system will be made to a private company in Russia. He has said that the deliveries to the Russian company will probably be made towards the end of the year. The Russian company will use Kalka to protect its facilities. A delegation from Pakistan has also visited Antalya to see the functions of the air defense system, the report said. The device is wanted for use in the security of concerts, rallies, transfers, and social events in Pakistan, he said. The company has so far developed nine anti-drone systems for Turkey's security forces. They will be used to prevent useless cargo transport, flights conducted by terrorists, or activities such as carrying drugs, bombs, and prohibited substances. The system is already being used by the Turkish armed forces to counter drone attacks. While Turkey has seen an increased bonhomie with Pakistan in recent times, the Nagorno-Karabakh conflict had Ankara and Moscow on different sides. In spite of the fear of sanctions, Turkey President Recep Tayyip Erdogan had bought the Russian S-400 air defense system in protest against the U.S. move to not sell him the state-of-the-art Patriot missiles. While Russia and Turkey are not allies, as per Dmitry Trenin, the director of the Carnegie Moscow Center, President Vladimir Putin is keen on preserving a peaceful relationship with Turkey, a rising regional power.